Hello everyone, welcome to a new video. Today we're going to be checking out the demo for Storyteller. This looks like a cool little create your own adventure kind of thing, which sounds very, very fun. So, go ahead and start. A book about the creation of stories. Chapter 1, Love and Loss. Alright, let's go. Chapter 2, oh, okay. Uh, first love. Lonely person finds love. Build a story that fits the title. Drag characters into the comic. Juliet finds Juliet and Juliet. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so I do have to use Albert. <laughs> like, can I just use three Juliets? So you're heartbroken, you find love. Gotcha. So, broken heart. Um, story of a heartbreak. So Albert, or wait. Oh, we set the scene, okay. Grave, propose. So... <laughs> okay, wait, what? What is going on? So, Albert died. Juliet's crying. She's like, oh my god, Albert's dead. Um, so... She sees Albert's go- <laughs> Okay, so the ghost is a- Because I killed Albert, now he's a ghost. Oh, that's amazing. Okay. Okay, I'm into this. Yes, this is good. This is good. Nope, nope, I like this. Oh, we can't... Okay, but... Hmm. Well, now they're in love. But... Now you're dead. Uh... Okay, so how am I supposed to get the good on this? I guess we... I guess we do this reversed. I, I, we have to do it reversed, huh? There you go. You two are in love, and then Albert dies. There we go. I liked my version better, personally, where they get tormented by the ghost of their dead lover. <laughs> but it's cool too. Uh, heartbreak is healed. Edgar, Eleanor, and Ligeia. Oh, do we have a? Uh, do we have a? Um, uh, like a triple thing going on here, so let's see here. How about Edgar and Eleonora get together? Uh, Edgar dies, and uh, Eleonora realizes that, you know what? Girls are pretty great. There we go. <laughs> Eleanor's like, you know what, Edgar? It's fine. I, I was gay anyway. It's cool. <laughs> Sorry, Edgar. <laughs> Everyone heartbreaks. Okay. Um. Ooh, I can create some crazy stuff here. Okay. Okay, here we go. Here we go. So, Edgar. Eleonora get together. Once again, Edgar dies. Eleanor is like, oh no, but it's okay because Ligeia is pretty damn cute. So they get together and then Edgar revives and he comes back and what happens? Let's see. He comes back and... Let's see here, let's see here, let's see here. Everyone heartbreaks. I wanted him to like come back and see, oh no, my, my wife left me, basically. And Edgar dies again. And no one goes to his grave this time. And then he revives again. There. <laughs> Edgar's just stuck in a loop. <laughs> no. Okay, everyone heartbreaks. How does, how does this work? Okay, I think I see. I think I see what it wants. So you two are together. You broke your heart. You two are together. Um, uh, so we need a grave. You. Oh, wait, no. You there. You break your heart. Okay. And then... So that's two people dead. So now Edgar needs to break his heart. So Edgar revives. And then... Grave, and Edgar sees 
you die. There we go. Okay, so they're kind of like puzzles too. This is really, really neat. I like this quite a bit. So funny. Gothic tragedies. Poison. Drink poison- drinks poison out of heartbreak. Okay, here we go. Propose. Um... So... Eleonora and Legea, like I said, they're together. This is- this is after Edgar revived. He sees that they're together, and he's like... You know... I'm done. I'm done. Okay, no. That's- that's not- that's not how it works. Okay. Okay. So, um, how is this going to work? So I guess it's you two get together, and then one of you drinks poison? Oh, is that not how it works? Huh? Is that not how it works? I thought, I thought, like, you two would be together, you drink poison, and one of you would die. Drinks poison out of heartbreak. Propose? Maybe... You... Get proposed to by him now, and he's like, uh-uh. She's like, yeah, 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 okay. She's like, uh-uh, I love another. And he's like, oh... Oh no. And then he drinks poison. There we go. <laughs> oh man, this game's dark. <laughs> Tragic lovers, okay. Double self-poisoning. Oh man, okay, we just really doing Romeo and Juliet now, huh? Okay, so Eleonora is actually like, you know what, Edgar? I'm bi. So we're good again. So let's see here. So you two do that. Then someone dies. Edgar dies again, because we always have Edgar die. And then, uh, Eleonora poisons herself, and then Edgar revives, and then he sees Eleonora's grave, and then he's like, you know what? I'm gonna follow in her footsteps, be the greatest damn poisoner I've ever been. Wow, this game's depressing. <laughs> Murder. Oh, Baron's gonna be the murderer. Look at this jackass. Okay. Baron murders Edgar. So, Edgar and Eleonora, you two are together. And then... How's this gonna work? Oh, maybe it's... Okay, so then it's Eleonora getting proposed to by Baron. And she's like, uh-uh, dude. I love Edgar. And then, grave with Edgar. No? There we go. Okay, that's what it needed to be. You, need, you needed to be the one that did the murder. I thought we had to show Eleonora at the grave all sad, but... Wow. The drama, the conflict. Baron murders Edgar again, but... Is it a... Oh. Okay, uh... Whoops. Propose. Edgar, Eleonora... Uh, they're together, and then they drink, um, poison? No. Maybe Edgar at the poison? No. Yeah, let's erase that. So drink. Okay, you're drinking. Uh-huh, and then, huh. I don't know. Let's see. Baron murders Edgar. How am I going to do that? Is the question. So, you two were seen together. Um, Eleonora. Wait. So, propose. Eleonora. Baron. He gets heartbroken. Um, poison? Baron? Yeah, there we go. He's like, oh, I'm going to murder this bastard. Yeah, and then, uh, drink with Edgar. Edgar dies. Okay, cool. Stories can use fewer frames. Interesting. Okay. Neat. Deadly drink. Okay, so that was chapter two. 
Monsters, Genesis, Dracula, and Crown Suitor. Judgment and Tempt? Oh, uh, we're doing Adam and Eve. Adam and Eve die. Uh, Garden. Adam. Eve. They're like, hey, you're pretty cool. Oh, no! Oh, no! <laughs> YouTube, please! YouTube, please, they're small! You can't see it, right? Oh, no! <laughs> Oh no! Guess I'm gonna have to cover that. All right. Um, or I'll forget, and this will just go up on YouTube, and YouTube will yell at me. Um, all right. Tempt. Let's see. Adam and Eve die. So then they get tempted. Eve gets tempted. Right. And then judgment. Eve. She gets zapped by the angry god. And then Adam's chilling in the garden. Uh, and Eve's dead. Oh, what? He sees that, oh man, she's been turned to that. So then Adam goes and eats the apple. Or not. And then he gets judgmented. Huh. How do I, how do I kill both of you is the problem. Hmm, because she... Eve ate the apple, she got zapped, Adam is horrified. He's like, oh my god, she got zapped. And I tried to get him to go to the tree, tree didn't work. Shit, what did Adam do that got him in trouble as well? Didn't he have to remove his leaf? Didn't he also have to wake up? To knowledge? But if I tried to tempt Adam, it's like, no, there's no... There's no, uh, serpent there to give the fruit. Oh, I guess before Eve died, they had to be in the garden again, talking to each other, because, yeah. That's what it was. That's what it was, right there. So, yeah. Yeah, she has to be alive. Okay, and tempt. There we go. Now, Adam, she gets- she tempts you with the fruit. Yeah, that was what happens, because... The Bible makes it seem like Eve is the bad one here, because of course it does. Um, alright, so he eats the fruit too. And then they both get bopped. And judgment. There we go. Yeah, God's like, uh-uh. You ate a fruit, man. You realized that you were naked, that's no good. Cured from vampirism. So, Jonathan, Mina, and Dracula. So... Dracula... In his crypt. Huh. Hmm. Let's see. That maybe that's not it. Mina and Jonathan at night, maybe? You two... Fall in love? Professor? Dracula. He's like, garlic. What do you two do, though? I don't... Uh... You gotta stake him through the heart. Wait. So what does Crypt do? Um, Jonathan? You're scared. Okay, so... Wait, why do I have you two falling in love together? What happens if one of you were just out at night? Oh! Oh. So, one of you's out at night. You two get married or whatever. And then one of you is out at night alone. Let's do Jonathan. And you get bitten by Dracula. Now you're a vampire. So, you find out that you're a vampire. Um, and you go see the professor? No. Uh, Mina goes and sees the professor. He's like, oh yeah, you gotta stake him. You gotta stake him. So... Dracula's chilling here, Mina's like, STAB! And then... They meet at night. Mina and Jonathan. There we go. Yeah! After killing Dracula, the one that created you, you're good. Cool. Wow, so neat.
I'm, I'm really into the idea of this game. The Queen marries. Hmm. Propose, Queen. Baron. She's like, get your ass on. So... Dungeon? He's put in a dungeon? <clears throat> what is this? So, disguise. Okay, so yeah, you're in jail, so we can't do that. So, let's do disguise. You. And then... Propose again, but you're a dragon? Aha, I am monster. No? Huh. Um... So... Dungeon, Queen, Baron? He has you in the dungeon. And then... Propose... Uh... Or maybe that's not it? Propose... Baron... Queen. No? What's happening here? What, what's the point of the disguise, I wonder? He's heartbroken, so he goes and gets the disguise. And then the and then he walks up on the queen. The queen is very scared, but what then? I don't get it. Maybe a uh, dungeon. You get put in there. Maybe. No, that's not what I wanted. So dungeon. You get put in there. Queen's like, haha. And then you take the disguise off? No. What? What? Is, I thought it was like, oh, I, he 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 would be like, I captured the dragon, and then she would marry him. Huh? Because evidently, trying to propose as a dragon does nothing. And we only have dungeon disguise and propose as our available options here. So, I was thinking the dragon needs to be defeated somehow. Let's try... Let's see, how about... We've tried to propose with you two. What about dungeon with you two? And you in there... That does something totally different. So... Huh. What happens if I disguise the queen? Okay, she's like, uh-uh. It has to be something with you disguising, then. And then, like, and that's what I thought. I thought, yeah, now that you're in the disguise, you put the queen in jail. Or does the queen also disguise? No. So if we propose queen you and swap you, nothing happens. You're just scared. And then, like... Yeah, this doesn't do anything. That's kind of what I thought. Like, oh, he puts on the dragon outfit, she's scared, he puts her in the dungeon. And then proposes again, but no, she's in the dungeon, so... That doesn't work. Huh, this one, this one has me stumped, actually. I don't know what I'm supposed to do here. Like, maybe I started it wrong? Maybe you need to... do that first, then... Show up, then... Huh. Yeah, my, my my brain is not working for this one. Not working at all. Dungeon, queen, duh. Like, it makes me feel like this is how it's supposed to work. Like, I'm thinking like, oh, the dragon captures the queen. Okay, let, now Baron takes the disguise off. Oh, I see. And then dungeon. Queen is in the dungeon. Baron saves her. And then does another proposal. And she's like, yeah. Okay, there we go. That one just took me a second. <clears throat> okay. And... There's more? Oh. Uh... Is that it? Did I do all the stuff in the demo? I guess so, huh? It says zero seven. So boom, boom, boom. 
11 out of 11. Yeah, okay, I did them all, so. I didn't get all the jester things, though? What, what is jester things? Huh? What is this? Heartbreak is healed. Two heartbreaks. Oh, these are like little challenges. Okay, two heartbreaks? How? Hmm. Two heartbreaks in this amount of time. So you two are together. Oh. Oh. I see. So you... Edgar dies. And Eleanor is like, eh. And then... Oh, wait, no. Let's do this. So propose. Let's do uh, Eleonora and Lea again. And then Edgar's like, ah, yeah. And then... You die. Two heartbreaks. Cool. Okay, so that's a that's a jester thing. These are like extra little challenges. Afterlife love. Okay, so you two are together. Edgar dies. You two are together. She dies. And then <clears throat> let's get rid of you. Get rid of you. So you're now sad because uh, Eleonora dies. Eleonora revives. And then reproposes to you? No, that doesn't count. So it has to be the ghost then, right? So propose. Oh, no, that's heartbreaking. Oh no. Okay, so wait. Wait, 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 wait. Let's let's just let's just do away with a lot of this. So um you two are together. Um you die. And then, uh, Eleonora also dies. And then, you two propose in the afterlife. There we go. These are so cool. I love this sort of game. Th these are always very fun to me, just kind of solving the puzzles in these weird way. Double self-poisoning uh, same person? Double self-poisoning same person. So, you two get together, um, Edgar dies, uh, so you poison yourself, which, that makes you die, right? So, Eleonora dead, and then Eleonora revives, and then Eleonora <laughs> poisons herself again. There we go. Yeah, she's like, uh-uh, nah, put me back. I don't want to be alive. Deadly drink. Baron steals spouse. Okay, so we just have to add an extra step here. Yep, that was easy. Man, that's messed up. <laughs> that's really messed up. Indigestion. What? So you eat, you eat, and then what? Eat, eat. And then you guys are over here. No? In the garden? Oh, do we just gotta make them eat a lot? Maybe? Yeah, there we go. I just had to make Adam sick by eating too many apples. Professor horrified at dead vampire. Oh, crypt, and then put the put Dracula and the professor in there. No. Oh, wait, no, just there we go. Wait, horrified at dead vampire. Right? How will I make you horrified of him? Professor horrified at dead vampire. How? Uh, oh, unless... So let's do away with you staking Dracula and instead have you stake Jonathan. And then show Jonathan. There we go. Yeah. Because of course he'd be happy that Dracula's dead. Crown suitor. Dragon King. Wait, so how... So, you're... Yeah, okay, so let's... 
Let's take away doing that and just move you back. And no. Put the thing on, capture you, put you in, and then come back and release you. Right? No, you're in jail still. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not gonna know how to get you to propose. It took me long enough just to figure out how to do this one in the first place. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I just realized I just have to do it reverse. So, disguise, Baron, propose to the queen as the dragon. Or, no, 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 wait, wait, wait. Whoops, I'm doing this the wrong way. So, Baron proposes to queen. He gets his heart broken. He puts the queen in the dungeon. He's like, ha ha ha. And then he goes and gets the uh, disguise on. And then he goes and frees you. And then she's like, oh my god, I love dragons. There we go. Wow, that's funny. What a neat idea. Okay, so I got all the all the crowns and all the jester hats. That was super super fun, actually. This game is awesome. I might have to play this when it comes out because yeah, that was a really good time. Just so ludicrous. Full version is coming soon with more character settings and surprises. Yeah. So yeah, I'm definitely gonna wish list that on Steam because that was really fun. So I hope you've enjoyed this little look at the storyteller demo, and I'll see you next time.